Hey, welcome to the extras. This is Windows 10, a near nine-year-old Microsoft operating system. And it's great. But there's just one thing. See, you recently upgraded to 10 from 7, and you don't really like it that much. It's too clunky on your old computer. And you decided that you want to go back to Windows 7. Well, today, that's exactly what we're going to be doing. We're going to be downgraded from Windows 10 to Windows 7. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get started. So, we're going to go into the Settings app. Go into Update and Security. Update and Security. There we go. Recovery. Oh, what is this? Go back to Windows 7. This option is only available for 10 days after you upgrade to Windows 10. Okay, let's get started. Go back to Windows 7. Getting things ready. This won't take long. All right, let's just leave it and let it do its thing. Okay, why are you going back? My apps and devices won't work on Windows 10. Windows 7 seemed easier to use. Windows 7 seemed faster. Windows 7 seemed more reliable. Or for another reason. So just for this example, we're going to go... Windows 7 seemed faster and Windows 7 seemed more reliable. Next, check for updates. Before you go back, try installing the latest update. This may fix the problems that you're having with Windows 10. No thanks. What you need to know, this might take a while and you won't be able to use your PC until it has finished. Leave your PC plugged in and turn on. After going back, you'll have to reinstall some programs. You'll lose any changes made to settings after the upgrade to Windows 10. Are your files backed up? I don't have any. This shouldn't affect them, but it's best to be prepared. Next, don't get locked out. If you use the password to sign into Windows 7, make sure you know it. You won't be able to sign in without it. Next, thanks for trying Windows 10. If you end up missing improved search, security and startup, come back to Windows 10 at any time. Go back restarting okay so yeah let's just start time lapse and let's let it do its thing Whoa, 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 okay, it, it, it worked, we're in Windows 7, so yeah, we're back, everything's exactly how we left it, except for this Microsoft Edge shortcut, but yeah, everything else is all good, so thank you guys for watching, if you enjoyed, leave a like, if you have something to say, leave a comment, if you want to see more, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later, bye.